Tarhana or trahana is dried food ingredient based on a fermented mixture of grain and yogurt or fermented milk found in the cuisines of Southeast Europe and Middle East. Dry tarhana has a texture of coarse, uneven crumbs, and it is usually made into a thick soup with water, stock, or milk. As it is both acidic and low in moisture the milk proteins keep for long periods. Tarhana is very similar to some kinds of kishk. The Armenian tarkana is made up of matzoon and eggs mixed with half of wheat flour and half of starch. Small pieces of dough are prepared and dried and then kept in glass containers and uses mostly dry soups, dissolving in hot liquids. The Greek trahana contains only cracked wheat or a couscous-like paste and fermented milk. The Turkish tarhana consists of cracked wheat or flour, yogurt, and vegetables fermented then dried. In Cyprus, it is considered a national specialty, and is often served with pieces of halloumi cheese in it. In Albania it is prepared with wheat, yogurt and butter and it is served with hot olive oil and feta cheese. Etymology <inaudible> 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 Hill and Breyer suggest that Tarhana is related to Greek tracton, tracton romanized as tractum, a thickener Apicius wrote about in the 1st century CE which most other authors consider to be a sort of cracker crumb. Dalby 1996 connects it to the Greek tragos, traganos, tragos, traganos, described and condemned in Galen's Geoponica 3.8. Weaver 2002 also considers it of Western origin. Perry, on the other hand, considers that the phonetic evolution of Traganos to Tarhana is unlikely, and that it probably comes from Persian, Traquan Tarkvane. He considers the resemblance to Traganos and to Trachis course coincidental, though he speculates that Trachis may have influenced the word by folk etymology. In Persian language sources, al Zamakshari mentioned the name of this food in the 11th century in the form Tarkana in his dictionary. It is attested in the 13th century in the form Tarkina in the Jahanguri Encyclopedia, named after Jahangir, the Mughal emperor of India. Tartar in Persian means wet, soaked, and Quan Quan pronounced khan means dining place, table, food, large wooden bowl. Thus in Persian it would mean watered or soaked food, which matches the way the soup is made. Tarhana must be soaked in water, and other possible ingredients are then added and cooked for some time. Regional variations of the name include Armenian Tarksana, Greek Trachanas Trahanas or Zino Chandros Zino Handros, Persian Trakin, Trakan Trakwan Tarkane, Tarkane, Tarkvane, Kurdish Tarksane, Albanian Trahana, Bulgarian Trahana or Tarhana, Serbo-Croatian Tarana or Trahana, or Turkish Tarhana. Manufacture Tarhana is made by mixing flour, yogurt or sour milk, and optionally cooked vegetables, salt, groats, and spices notably tarhana herb, letting the mixture ferment, then drying, and usually grinding and sieving the result. The fermentation produces lactic acid and other compounds, giving tarhana its characteristic sour taste and good keeping properties. The pH is lowered to 3.4 to 4.2, and the drying step reduces the moisture content to 6 to 10 percent, resulting in a medium inhospitable to pathogens and spoilage organisms, while preserving the milk proteins. Topic: <laughs> Preparation. Tarhana are cooked as a thick soup by adding them to stock, water, or milk and simmering. In Albania it is made with wheat flour and yogurt into small pasta-like chunks which are dried and crushed. The powder is used to cook a soup which is served with bread cubes. In Cyprus it is common to add cubes of halloumi cheese towards the end of cooking. See also List of soups Taranya, a Hungarian noodle whose name comes from Tarhana Frumenti, a Western European equivalent Kashk Sampa, a similar product in Tibet and Nepal Food portal